Hey, Region 8, Brad Harris here, Region 8 DP Chairman and the Meet Director for the 2021 Level 9 and 10 Regional Championships. Marion Dykes, Region 8 Tech, will be the Meet Referee for the weekend, and Deb Cornegay, Region 8 Administrative Chair, will serve as our Meet Administrator. You will also be hearing from them. Ryan Corrigan of Meet Authority will be in charge of scoring and sound. We will also have several state chairs on hand at the venue throughout the weekend to answer any questions that you may have. For pre-meet information, go to the Level 9 and 10 Regional Championships page at meetmaker.com. When arriving at the venue, make sure you sign in and receive your red coach's bracelet. That bracelet will need to be worn throughout the weekend so that we can identify you as signed in and verified. The closest gym to the entry is going to be Gym A. That is going to be marked in red. And Gym B will be marked in blue, and that will be closest to the head table. We will be using a modified Capital Cup format, using a general stretch of 20 minutes in length. Once the 20 minutes has concluded, our Flight A athletes will proceed to their first warm-up event, and we will begin. Once we get towards the end of their first warm-up period, our Flight B athletes will then line up in front of their, their first competitive event and we will do our presentation of teams. Only the athletes in Gym B will line up. Once the Flight A athletes are done with their first time warm up, we will have all athletes stand in front of their first event. We will play the national anthem and once the anthem concludes, our Flight A athletes will begin their competition. Once competition begins for our Flight A athletes, our Gym B athletes may begin their first time warm up period. We will announce rotations via microphone or via a chime, meaning that there will be no continuous rotations. Please do not have your athletes present themselves to the judges for distancing purposes. Please plan on playing your own music, but there will be a representative from Meet Authority to help if that need arises. Due to COVID restrictions, it will be impossible for us to provide catered coaches hospitality at regional championships. It is simply too expensive for the number of coaches that we are expecting. There will be bottled water and soft drinks available throughout the weekend, and please be advised that outside food is allowable. You can either eat that outside or you can eat it in the coach's area. There will also be a concession stand available for food purchase. We apologize for any inconvenience. Trainers will be available to the, to the right of the head table, and it'll be a very tight schedule, coaches, so we're gonna need everybody's cooperation. And with that said, each general stretch will start on time in Gym A if we run a little bit behind in Gym B so that we can make sure that we get done in our allotted time period. That is it for my part. Thanks a lot and good luck in your preparation and go Region 8. Hello, I'm Deb Carnegie, your Region 8 Administrative Committee Chairman. Congratulations for qualifying athletes to the 9-10 regional meet. We are so excited that we get to have a competition season this year in 2021. I hope this video gives you the information you need for a successful regional competition. Coaches, once you enter the competition area, please have at least one of your coaches check in at the scores table as soon as possible. Rotation sheets will be taped down to the table and there will be a highlighter provided. Please find your gym's name at the top part of the sheet and highlight it. This will shorten our roll call at the coaches meeting later. If you have any scratches, please mark through the athlete's name and leave their competition number so we can find them to scratch them in the program. By doing this, if we have to rearrange squads, we will be able to do it prior to the main coaches meeting. If scratches make squads unbalanced, we will draw to move athletes to another squad to balance out the session your starting event could change. Even though you watch this entire video, you will need to come to the coaches meeting at the first part of each session. There are three very good reasons to attend the coaches meeting. Although each age group of nines and tens have seven slots for athletes to qualify to nationals, there are times that Region 8 receives additional spots. Sometimes we don't know these extra slots until during competition. We will do scratches at every session, so we need to know any that you have that didn't get marked ahead of time, if scratches make the squads unbalanced again, we will do a draw to move athletes to another squad to balance out the session. We do a drawing at the beginning of each session. You must be present to win. If your name is called and you're not there, then we will draw somebody else's name. 
I will enter all the qualified athletes to Easterns and JO Nationals. The Tim Rand Fund will pay entry fees for Easterns and JOs. You will receive a confirmation email from USA Gymnastics. Please let me know if any of your athletes are missing. Prior to regionals, I will ask for your administrator and your coaches for your gym. Please let me know at regionals if you have not sent this in or if you have any changes. You can add or make changes to coaches yourself. Coaches of qualified athletes must fill out apparel forms before they leave the meet site. Please do not go into the apparel room when the athletes are in the room. All apparel and competition information is in the apparel room. Coaches must wear regional apparel at nationals and at easterns or your state account will be fine. USA Gymnastics requires that all participants and spectators wear a facial covering and maintain social distancing throughout the duration of any gymnastics state and regional championship event. Facial coverings should be fitted or cone style and consist of multi layers of fabric. Bandanas, neck gaiters, face shields, and masks with valves are not permitted. These must be worn during all competition. Coaches must wear facial coverings at all times and maintain social distancing when not spotting. During the competition, athletes must wear facial coverings at all times outside during performance of gymnastics. All other participants, judges, event staffs, and spectators are required to wear facial covering at all times and may maintain social distancing. Below is a link for the mask mandate. All athletes that are 18 years or older must complete Safe Sport U110 before they can compete at regionals. There will be a banner at the chief judge table for each event. That way you can orient your gymnast to know which one to salute to begin her routine. Please complete the high school senior form that is on the Region 8 website. That's www.region8gymnastics.org so that we can honor each one of our high school seniors at the award ceremony. We will have training camp forms available at regionals. Also, the address book form is online. That is very helpful for your state and regional chairmen at this time of year to get all the information you need to you. Region 8 Congress is July 15th through the 18th in New Orleans, Louisiana. Hi, I'm Marion Dykes. Welcome to Regionals 2021, the year of the pandemic. We are so excited to be here as the judging panel. After no regionals in 2020, 2021 promises to be a fabulous year. I want to go over a couple of things with you that may make our journey through the regional weekend easier. As already noted, we must have on a mask. I don't think you need to go as far as I did with multiple masks, but we want to be sure we're there and safe for the athletes. I want to ask you as coaches, if you have a skill that has not been performed in competition before, to be sure and submit the paperwork you have on that skill so your athlete receives the proper value. That paperwork should be given to me prior to the session of your athlete that is participating in and I will present it to the judges to make sure that all judges give the same value. I am here all weekend if you have questions on anything that your athlete has done or things that you may be thinking of changing for your athlete. If you have anything that the athlete has done that leads you to question a score, I would like to talk to you about it prior to submitting any inquiry. Once you actually submit the inquiry, it could result in your score being raised or lowered or may stay the same. Therefore, we want to be sure that you really want to inquire before paperwork is submitted. We would ask coaches to only have the competitive athletes for that session on the floor. If there are extra athletes there as spectators, that will have to happen through admissions who will govern the social distancing required, and the number of people allowed in the stands. The only competition athlete should be in the floor for that session. This competition is true open scoring. Each judge will flash their start value at their judging table. 
and their individual scores will be flashed on the electronic scoreboard. If a coach misses that, please feel free to ask me and I will look that up for you prior to any inquiry. Coaches are reminded there should be no signals or verbal cues. And even bars, you may have more help than you are used to. Please be sure that the bars are set accurately and tightened accordingly. In addition, be sure that the board is moved so that there is no deduction for failure to remove the board. Regionals is a true draw. You may not change your order because of bar settings or because of height of gymnasts on other apparatus. Regionals does mandate that you go in the order that is drawn. Double check before competition that each gymnast only has one stud earring per ear. There cannot be any large earrings or hoops, and there can be no other jewelry. Please take those out prior to competition. Please remind the gymnast that the hip bone should not be exposed by pulling their leotard up. Please remember that the meet referee table is near the head table. If you have any questions during the competition or want to file an inquiry, please bring that to me at the head table. We hope you have a terrific competition. We are looking forward to it and wish the best of luck to your athletes. Good luck. I am ready for competition. <laughs>